Let's do it. Boom. I gotta not choke again. Just chew your food. Do it carefully. You'll be fine. I almost choked the other night on a piece of bread. <laughs> like it got stuck in my throat <laughs> and I was like, this is it. That's you one just of eating that bread. Now I've been mouth. very conscious conscious to uh, like chew my food. That's actually one of my like very reasonable rational fears is yeah, just I'm choking gonna choking on something and living alone. Yep. Well, I think you can like kind of like give yourself the Heimlich by slamming yourself against like, a, <laughs> a wall chair. Or yeah. yeah. <laughs> a wall? How do you give yourself Anything. the Heimlich on a wall? <laughs> I don't know. Why does a chair eat better? You have the edge a of the wall chair, chair on top. <laughs> because a chair you can lean into. You're gonna slam yourself against a wall. <laughs> for well, the like you, in like a door frame. What? You can do it. I'm a fucking I don't know. idiot. I don't understand. I'm just picturing you like you know that clip of that dude just like running and belly flopping against a wall. That's what no. I'm picturing right now. <laughs> okay, well enjoy your chair. <laughs> well, while you're slamming yourself into a wall, dying. <laughs> I'll Nick likes to go at full, full run, and then he jumps up, <laughs> turns sideways, yeah. and just hits a door frame really fast. Listen, a door frame is useful. <laughs> I use door frames to fix my back all the time. You got a kink in your back? Push it against the door frame. Oh, yeah, I mean, you can kind of like, yeah, massage your uh, your lower spinal erectors. Well, I use it up on like my shoulders. Oh, okay. You can, you should look at all kinds under of your shoulder blades, kind of. You like push it in there if you like if you like <laughs> sleep on it wrong. Mm. You can also lacrosse ball, dude. Yeah, I have a lacrosse ball, like handy. You can get one specifically for that reason. I've never heard of lacrosse ball for your back until this very moment. Oh, okay. So I, I well, it is. Uh, it's a thing that you can do. I also have a foam roller, so <clears throat> that's good. I feel like that. I don't need that. That's good. I live and die by the foam roller. Mm -hmm. The foam roller. I sort of. You feel a cold coming on? Use a foam roller. I, I don't know if it works that way, but... <laughs> well, it doesn't, but, like, anything, like, uh, if my back starts getting sore, just... Use the foam roller. It feels great. Um, I'll do it, do it horizontally, or, or I'll put it vertically with my spine, and then you roll from side mm. to side. Oh. In the... In the my, side to side? In my pickaxe from yeah. side to side. <laughs> foam roll is not so enough good. for me. I need, like, I need more targeted on my... Uh, lower back. I had a, I got a massage the other day, and I was like, "Can you just basically go as hard as you possibly can on my lower back?" And so she literally climbed on top said. of me and put all of her weight on her elbows into Jeez. my lower back, and it was Hell the greatest yeah. thing that's ever happened. I've never had a massage. Jesus Christ, you're missing out. Yeah, I've never had like a mani pedi, anything like pampering like that. I have that. never I've had never a mani pedi. Anything. Massages are just they're my they're my weakness. I feel like I would like it. Yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely. It's 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 a brilliant thing. And also, I bet you there are people watching this because a massage isn't something you usually get and are used to until you're paying for it yourself. And so, if you're like, you know, high school age or younger, you're probably not just going out and getting massages. So for no, everyone you watching, you also don't this, need a massage when you're young. Yeah, but it still it feels good regardless. And yeah. maybe some people in high school, they're lifting weights. so They had massages at our graduation party at, at, for high school. That's interesting. Hmm. Did you guys ever have that thing? Like, it was the, it was after graduation. We spent we spent the night in the school. And, like, the school was, like, oh, renovated. No. Like, 1.5. Uh, no, never. Like, never there was, that. like, you could play, like, fake gambling games. Like, there was, like, a little fake, like, fake, just, like, a casino thing. Okay. Uh, and then there was like a movie theater, and um, at the end there was like a magic show. <laughs> there was like a big bouncy castle in the gymnasium, stuff like that. No, I didn't have that. There and was, then we uh, stayed there until like 5 a.m. There was Disneyland grad night, but... Oh. That's a much more Southern California thing to do. Yeah, when you, you live in Minnesota, have Disneyland grad out. night? <laughs> I feel like this is exactly the same It basically map. is the same map. Unless they change something like halfway through it. Yeah, I think it's the so same. So far, now. it's in exactly the same. Yep. Yeah, this seems pretty much I, the same. I, I don't. Maybe he adjusted some distances here and there, but it wasn't meant for people who had played Memes One. This is like Spider Man One Point Five. Whoa! Was... No, because <clears throat> he needs he needs the feedback from all the people who have played Memes One to tell him if this one's the good version or not. So it's Did ready you guys for know wide release. Spider Man One Point Five. 
I I didn't watch Spider Man 1.5. I don't know. I don't even know what they changed, but they were like, we needed more money between Spider Man 1 and 2, so we're gonna release Spider Man 1.5. Are you actually being serious? Yes, it's, it was actually what? released. What? I think it has like deleted scenes or something, or. I've never heard of this. I haven't this heard of this, yeah. It, it was released on di on DVD as Spider-Man 1.5. Was this like a straight-to-DVD Tobey Maguire Spider-Man? No, it's like Spider-Man 1, but they added the, like stuff that was cut out, I guess? No, but it, like is that. it the Tobey Maguire Spider-Man? Yeah, it's that one. I did not know that they did that. That's it's not bizarre. a different movie. It's the same movie, but it's... I think it they was like... They just call it were... Spider-Man 1.5, but it was like the same... Wow, that was a little tricky thing I didn't even, know. I didn't even did there. intend for that. <clears throat> Too bad it didn't work for you. I want to say it was either... <laughs> what are you doing, doing, Nick? I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I think it was in between, like, before Spider-Man 2 came out, so, like, they were trying to get was that it? money. They made, for... like, a Lion King one and a half, and that was to document the, the time on the log Fuck as me. they're crossing the log, and all of a sudden Simba's old. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. I didn't watch it. But it, that, in that case, it made sense because that a lot of time passes in that one little walking across the log scene. One and a half has 30 minutes of more footage, deleted scene and scenes and filler. I mean, that just sounds like director's <laughs> cut. Not yeah, it's like an extended, it's like, yeah, an extended edition or whatever. But yeah, they just called it Spider-Man 1.5. Hmm. 30 extra minutes of just Sam Raimi on screen doing his own thing. I Sam could be Raimi, the director. I've never seen it, but you know. How you doing? Sam Raimi, kind of a G. <clears throat> Is he the director of uh, the Spidey Man? Yes. No, I didn't the, know they... the first three. The uh -huh. first, yeah, first three. They have an excellent level of campiness. <sighs> oh God! Provided by Samuel Raimi himself. My my I, favorite. I don't know how someone like Sam Raimi could possibly make Spider Man three though. It seems so weird. My favorite I think, is I, just. No, I think it totally makes sense because the the scenes that are bad and that are extra campy and it's like very they're very Sam Raimi. Yeah, but it's not like Sam Raimi. Yeah, his movies are campy, but the humor, I it's not so like trying to beat you over the fucking head, you know? Mm -hmm. It was and definitely in that a, movie. It was a really misstep. bad. Listen, two out of three movies ain't bad. Two, out, and we're like, <laughs> I guess. Two, two I guess of them, two of them are good. But I mean, wouldn't you weight Spider-Man three so heavily that it actually affects the other two no, as well? Right. No, I don't think so. I because I I don't know. I see. I'm very light on Spider-Man three. Also, like I've I've re I rewatched it recently and uh, like it's not it's not good, but it, I don't think it's the worst. Like there are good parts of it. There are entertaining bits. The best bit but definitely... is the emo scene without the music. I stand well, by that. <clears throat> oh, oh so close. Me, no. You almost did it, man. <laughs> you have 10 seconds. You no, you have 10 still seconds. Do it. You could have done it. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> okay. He knows he can't win. <laughs> he could have he could have finished that easily. I can't win either cuz yeah, you I don't even know what the score place, is. So. Um, uh, Jordan was ahead I'm by in 20 last place. on me, so. Oh, yes. Yeah, it, would, it wouldn't have mattered. What was it that? wouldn't have mattered. The uh, double DNF right there, dude, or triple D? Yeah, double triple man, DNF. I don't even care. I don't know. Double DNF. I don't know, dude. There's there some go. DNFs in there. I'm sorry, man. Oh, but it's okay. We have time to add another, and I, I've got safety in my numbers, so it's mm. cool. But it hasn't been 10 minutes yet, so we gotta do speed. We gotta do speed. Here we go. Five Fortnite streamers who have sworn. Is that an article on BuzzFeed or something? Are you not familiar with that meme? No, I'm not. No, it's just a meme. Yeah. What the hell? Oh, I mean, no. it's, it's from what? an actual video. But... What the? Yeah, hell? it's from a video, what? but it's what like is happening. It's like some dumb channel made it. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! It's just one oh, of those YouTube boy. channels that like takes stream did footage and makes combo. Oh, on. I did. I did. For I'm a still little going. Bit, and then I rolled. Burger King foot Dead. lettuce. That didn't work. The the worst thing you could have on your Burger King burger is. Foot lettuce. Go, keep it, keep it together, keep it together, keep it together. Oh god, oh god. How do you fucking do this? How do you? No! Do it? I can't believe I've done this. I, I was so, I was so perfect. What? That time I just crashed on the first landing. It didn't even. I was so dude. Perfect. Bye guys. Come on, come on, come on. No, this is bullshit. Come on. 
Jordan's this is gonna so lose RNG, right it's crazy. I, I mean, I did kind of lose control. Like I did like a 720 down court, dude. I did a 6, 7, See, I finally got a run where it didn't flip me at all, and now I'm going to make yeah, this good. No, you're good. You just got to keep it together, which I should have done the first time I got to that point, and then I didn't, and it lost it for me. I just got lucky that time, and it didn't flip me on the initial landing. Oh, we tied. Brilliant. Yeah. Brilliant. Okay. Well, there we go. We hit our 10-minute threshold. Um, Let's see. Let's see. So transparent. 